Hey, how's it going? Thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch this video that I made for you. Um, this video is going to give you an understanding of your position on Google and give you an, al an analysis of your SEO marketing, right? Um, so I just want to jump into the video. As you can see, we're on one of my business pages. My company's Amp Local. Uh, we're an internet marketing company. We do web design, PPC management, SEO, um, and lead generation, okay? So let me just jump over to your website. So here's your website, LA Creative. Um, so as you kind of already know, there's 82% of the populations on Google, right? Um, so it's very important that if you're going to have a website to, you want to drive traffic to it in order to, to, to get those valuable prospects to your website, you know, and turn them into buying customers. Um, so I'm going to show you some things and, and talk about some things that how we get you there. Okay. Um, Google has an algorithm, all right? It actually has 200 determining factors, all right? I'm not going to talk about all of them. I'm just going to talk about four of the very most important ones, okay? Um, but before I get, get into that, I want to talk about how we find you on the Internet. So it's all about keyword research, all right? So the first thing, you are an advertising company, an advertising agency, um, yet that word is more irrelevant compared to marketing agency okay so for Los Angeles um, if you were to go to Google and type in marketing agency Los Angeles that would be the more natural way for you for someone to find you they could find you through advertising agency as well um, there's many keywords to find you uh, marketing agency uh, marketing or uh, like I already said uh, advertising agency maybe even digital marketing because you do some web design and stuff like that in social media but it looks like you shoot commercials uh, and do all that cool stuff in video so I think uh, for you marketing agency would be the best one you wanted to dominate um, but of course keyword research we would find out all of the keywords and just own all of those searches um, so for you we would type in um, uh, marketing agency so let me go back to Google here uh, so here we go marketing agency Los Angeles I didn't find you on the first 10 pages I mean if you're not on page one you might as well be on page 20 I'm gonna just be honest um, some of the big players here uh, one of the biggest ones here I just want to point out I'm using for an example for this one is blitz agency yeah they're ranked number two and they're also a number two in maps so you may already know this is your maps listings and this is your organic listings okay so the goal is to get you within the top three of these so this is what the click ratio looks like so when somebody hits this search 35 percent of the clicks are going to go to the number one ranked person in the maps and 35 percent is going to go to number one person ranked into organic so if you're ranked number one in both um, that's literally 70 percent of, of the clicks of the home page so that's huge okay um, so that's always the end goal and that's where we can get you um, so let me show you this real quick um, a lot of these tools that I use to find information about your website it looks like your website's brand new um, so there's not really uh, the internet's really not giving me too much data on your website which is fine you know you're looking to grow obviously you reached out to me you want to get more prospects you want to get your business growing online and great let's do it so for this one I'm gonna show you blitz agency they're the ones ranked number two so look at how much traffic they're pulling in uh, to their website like 29,000 clicks a month that's huge okay what would you do with 30,000 clicks a month I mean if you if you're elite pack just what five grand starting off that I saw I mean multiply that times 10,000 I mean, what does that even look like? I don't have a calculator. It's definitely over probably five million bucks or so. Yeah, something like that. So yeah, huge potential. Um, they're killing it. Obviously, you know they got it going on. So let me show you uh, the top four things that we focus on when we do SEO marketing. All right. First thing is content. So when I go to your web page here, authoritative content on the home page. That's what Google wants to see. Are you mentioning? Uh, relevant keywords such as marketing agency, advertising agency in Los Angeles. Um, all of these keywords, all right, we're going to find out the top ones. Um, actually, for you, some of the top ones would be uh, this is not yours. Uh, here, I'll just do this real quick while you're here. Let me go to Blitz. Let me show you how to find out the top keywords. I use Alexa.com. This is just one tool I use. So I'll go in here, punch it in. 
scroll down. Okay, so here's here's some of their top keywords. So you can see digital agency is another one, another key one you want to be on the top of. They're pulling 47% 40 of all their traffic from that. So that's one we would definitely take and consider. Marketing agency is only taking in actually about 4% of that. I mean, if you did 4% of 30,000, it's still a crap load of clicks. Um, but digital agencies literally pulling in half. So that's what that's how I would find the, the keywords. So if we wanted to completely just take away the business from Blitz Agency, we would we would uh, that's how we would do it. So digital agency. I don't normally do this on my videos, but I just go ahead and do it. So do digital agency. Um, and there there they are. Blitz at number five. Okay. So that looks like it's a more frequently searched term in Los Angeles if they're pulling if that's full, pulling 47% and they're ranked number 5 for that. So these guys are pulling in more more uh clicks there. So I mean just huge you're in Los Angeles, huge city. There's like uh, uh 4 million people or so. Um so I mean there's just just incredible amounts of potential out there if you know how to target it right. So back to authoritative content. Mentioning all those keywords on the home page, you know, um, at least 1,000 to 2,000 words on the home page, okay? And that's something that we could definitely get done for you. Um, this, your home page is kind of like a good, um, you know, welcome to my website, click on what you want to know about kind of thing. Um, but you definitely want to have authoritative content right there on the home page. All right, this, let me show you what it looks like, authoritative content. I typed an elephant on Google. Look what's number one, elephant in Wikipedia. This is what authoritative content looks like. All right, this is a little excessive. This is like 50,000 plus words. Nobody's going to read this unless they're writing a paper. Um, but this is just to give you an example, okay? But maximum 2,000 words, 1,000 to 2,000 words, just elaborating about what you do, who you are, and why you do it, pretty much. Next, uh, let's talk to you about citations, okay? These are super important. Some examples, Facebook, Bing, Yahoo. Looks like you're not on Google. Um, so looks like we got to get your business Google verified actually. Um, white pages, yellow pages. So these are some examples of these. All right. So you have to be listed in, in, in all of these for these to take you serious. So you're actually, I'm just not realizing this. Um, I didn't catch this earlier when I did this, but since you're not in Google at all, you're not going to be in the searches. So if we want to get you ranked in the maps and we want to get you ranked organically, we got to get you Google verified. Okay. That's that's like the very first thing we have to do for your business and get a, is go, get a Google verified, and then get you listed in all of these. These are the top fifty in the country. There's thousands. Um, over time, we want to get you listed in hundreds and hundreds of these, um, but definitely get you Google verified because you're 100 percent error rate. So Google is not even looking at you at all right now. Um, so let's see. This is uh, La Jolla. One sec. Let me just double check this real quick. 2102 India Street, Los Angeles, California. Okay. And that's not the, uh, that's not the zip code. Let me get the zip code for that real quick. That's going to be 939. Cool. All right, so 939. Bam. All right, so there we go. Same deal um, with your address in there. So it had it was picking up the, the name of the company and the phone number. Um, just had to make sure that address was in there. So still 100% error rate. Needs to be Google verified. So this is super, super important this is what gets you in the the map rankings right here okay are these citations next let me talk to you about um backlinks okay uh so say if you have a company um you know thoroughly impressed with your service um they say they write articles have a website or do blogs all right what they'll do is actually post an article about your website on their website so anyone read an article can click the link and go to your website so that's phenomenal because now you have a new prospect but most importantly Google can see you have a vote all right Google's like a popularity contest it's like running for president the more votes you have the more likely you're gonna win all right so that's in a just how it works that's what these backlinks are so for your what you're looking at a blank screen right now for your website um, 
you pretty much don't have any backlinks established. That's why nothing's here. Um, so let me show you Blitz, Blitz Agency. So they have a trust flow of 41, citation of 42. What does that stuff mean? So let me show you this chart. And then referencing domains. So a few numbers I want you to look at. Referencing domains, 514, and then trust flow of 41. All right, so this is a chart that measures the quality of those 500 domains. All right, this is the trust flow meter. All right, so if you have... Um, a trust flow of 15 you meet medium quality if it's at 20 it's high quality these guys are 41 so they're very very high quality okay so the good thing about doing business with me I actually can get these backlinks um, for you all right oh, one sec all this stuff got messed up so I get these backlinks for you um, these high quality domains and I reference your website all right so all of the uh, domains that I get, they're all 35, 40 plus. All right, it's very, very high quality domains to uh, beat the competition, just like it's posted here. Okay, um, so that's backlinks. So let me talk to you about being mobile friendly. Um, so you, as you may already know, 60, 80 percent of the population are on their iPhone or Android, you know, searching for a product or service in their area. So you got to be mobile friendly, um, which you are. So I did uh, show you that. And then your competitor, this is just one of the other competitors they are mobile friendly. So I just want to show you that because it's one of the four things Google takes very seriously. Um, so that's pretty much it uh, as far as the SEO marketing, um, those fee four determining factors. Um, there's other things that we look at, you know, your phone number, your address, is it all located in Los Angeles? So all those things are very important for the address. When we get it Google verified, it has to be in Los Angeles. Okay. Um, so again, I appreciate the time you took to watch this video. Um, if any, if any of this makes sense for you and your business, um, I'd love to work with you. Just uh, email me back, and we could talk about the next steps to go further. Again, thanks for your time. Have a good day.